Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to install mods on Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.9.4. So to make things easier than I have in the past, I actually have an app now that will help you download all the tools that you're going to need to actually do this. So look in the description for the Dogger 2011 app and download and install that APK. Once you've done that, go over and open it. Go to MCPE Downloads and Three things you're going to need is obviously Minecraft, you're going to need Block Launcher Pro 1.7.3, and you're going to need Mods for PE2. So Mods for PE2 actually has two different downloads. It's got the Play Store and it's got the APK. I recommend that you get the Play Store version because that has, you know, that'll notify you when there's updates and that kind of stuff. The APK doesn't do that obviously, so I recommend that you get the Play Store version, download it through that, and then you'll have the latest version. So if you have two buttons here at the bottom. You can either open up regular Minecraft or you can up, uh, open up Block Launcher Pro if you have both of those installed. And that will help you just, you know, it makes it a little bit easier, a little bit quicker to get to those once you have things set up. But we want to go and actually download a mod. So let's go to Mods for PE2. Now really quick, I wanted to point out that I'm actually going to be making my own. Well, I'm actually in the middle of making my own Mods app. It'll be a little bit slim, it's a little bit similar to it, this app that we're using here, but it's going to have quite a bit more. It'll be an all-in-one Minecraft modding app, so hopefully you guys stick around to see that. I'll be making videos, oh geez, videos about it shortly. <laughs> Alright, let's get the Walk Faster mod. Click on it, it'll download, and it has been saved. So let's open up Block Launcher Pro. Alright, so hit the wrench here up top, go to Patch Mods in Game, and I have every single mod downloaded already, going through all of them, but when you actually open this up, it won't be enabled by default, you have to go and find your mod, and then you have to enable it yourself, so let's click on the walkfaster.mod, hit enable, and then it's automatically ready to go, so let's hit back, let's go to play, let's go to my world, and let's see. Oh wow, we're walking quite a bit faster. And you can see I also have the mod, the climbing mod where I'm actually like floating and I can climb up stuff. Turn that down a little bit. See, I'm going quite a bit faster and I'm climbing up walls. So take a look through the mods for PE2 uh, mod list and see you know what you like and different things and try them out. And if they don't work, you can go over to the uh, 500 internal server air thread he's made one on the minecraft forums you can go over there and inform him because he's a developer but don't leave a review on the play store you know saying the mods for pe2 developers or whatever it's their fault because i've seen people do that before where they leave a review for that app and when a mod doesn't work and stuff and it's not their fault they're not actually developing the mod they're just making an app that'll download it and the app is really pretty cool so, you know, hats off to them for doing that, and just wanted to let you guys remember that, because, you know, like I said, I've seen people do that before. But really quick, I did want to talk a little bit about the app that I'm making. So, the app I'm making is called MCPE Mod Locator. So, it'll have, you know, servers, seeds, maps, uh, patches, mod scripts, all that kind of stuff, all in one app. And that'll be coming out shortly. It'll be on the Play Store, but right now I'm just doing a beta of it with an APK. So I'm adding mods to it just today, actually, all the mods that came out. And it is actually looking pretty good. And it's just all in one, so that's why I was hoping people would like it. So if you want to check it out, I've made a video for it on this channel. And if you haven't seen it yet, then I recommend that you subscribe to this channel and wait for the videos to be uploaded, which they will be coming in just a few days and it won't be the final version it'll just be a beta but it's come along pretty pretty far since the last video so thought i should just do an update on it so that'll be coming soon so hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next one thanks for watching